Heavy traffic is expected at the woodlands and tourist checkpoints from May 21 to June 23, said the Immigration and Checkpoints Authority ICA in a statement on May 20. This covers the lead-up to and during the Vesak Day public holiday on May 22 and the June school holidays. ICA said travellers should expect delays due to stepped-up security measures at the checkpoints caused by the heightened threat situation. It has advised travellers to factor in additional time for immigration clearance. The Ministry of Home Affairs said on May 18 that it has stepped up security measures at the checkpoints following an attack on a police station in Ulu Tyram Town, in Johor, on May 17. These measures include increased patrols and enhanced checks on travellers, it said. A check of the Beat the Jam app on May 19 at about 11 p.m. showed that travellers crossing the causeway could expect to take between three and four hours to enter Singapore, while those using the second link in tours may take one and a half to two and a half hours. ICA said that during the Good Friday long weekend from March 28 to April 1st, almost 2.3 million travellers crossed the two land checkpoints connecting Singapore and Malaysia, marking more than 455,000 crossings daily. This was close to a 30% increase in travellers compared with the Good Friday long weekend in 2023, said ICA. It added that during peak periods at the recent Good Friday long weekend, those travelling by car waited for up to three hours before they were cleared through immigration due to traffic tailback from Malaysia. ICA reminded all motorists to check the traffic situation at the land checkpoints and to not cut queues, as it would cause severe congestion and endanger other motorists. Errant motorists caught queue cutting will be turned away and made to requeue, ICA warned. Those travelling by car are encouraged to use QR codes instead of passports. For faster and more convenient immigration clearance, the authority added.